So how can you change the control center on your Android? Let's get into it. So right now, by default, you might have the control center looking like this. So at first you swipe down to access the notifications panel and you have a couple of controls there. And if you scroll down one more time, all of them appear. So at first, like the first layer is to customize and change the existing one. So you can uh, go ahead and click on the three dots at the top right and perform the edits, like the edit uh, toggles. You can remove those you don't need, add the ones which are available but not visible currently. And obviously you can reorganize them and make sure that the ones you use the most are on the first page or obviously set it up exactly the way that you want. So this is okay because it allows you to stick with the default operating system and you still have some room to customize it and change it. On the other hand, there are apps which can in fact replace the control center which you use right here. And those might be useful, but it require a bit more of a setup. So for example, there is an app called Me Control Center, so M-I Control Center, and it is an app you can download for free from the Google Play Store. And once you install it and just go through the setup process, you can end up with a brand new control center, which is completely different. Essentially, you can customize it within the app, and then you have to enable it by clicking on the uh, power on button within the app. You will then need to give this app permission to do all of these changes, right? So there are so many different areas where you need to give it a permission. So it needs to have permission to access your notifications and dual SIM and all of these things like accessibility. So you have to, you have to give it all like full access to replace the built-in control center. But once you do, you will end up with a completely new one and this is how you can change it. So uh, that's essentially how it works. Let me know below in the comments if there are some other ideas or things you have had in mind before. Subscribe for more tutorials and videos like this one and I'll talk to you later.